In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your ET2720 Epson printer. So let's start with the unboxing and then... Connect it with the power cable and press the power button. Now go to the printer screen and select your language. On the next screen, click the OK button. Press OK on the next screen. Press OK to proceed. Again press OK to install the setup ink and start the ink installation. The ink chamber is in the front so we can open it. Also open the ink seal. To install the ink we need to open the bottle and simply place the bottle, press it down and let the ink go. So this might take a minute or less than that so just wait for that. Once the ink is filled in, just shake it little bit and take it out. Place the ink cartridge like this. Press it down and let the ink go. So now we will install the last ink. Go to the printer screen. Go to the printer screen and press and hold the question button for 5 seconds. Click on the start button. So once it is complete, click done button. You can adjust the print quality now or you can do it later. So I'll do it later. Once you see the main screen that means printer is almost ready and we have to do the Wi-Fi setup so that we can add in other devices. For the Wi-Fi setup scroll ahead, select Wi-Fi setup and click OK. Select Wi-Fi recommended, click OK to proceed, Wi-Fi setup wizard, select your Wi-Fi network and enter its password. Now enter the password using the characters. So I'll change it to the numbers. Go for the next. To select the alphabet, select from here. Setup is complete, so click yes. Next thing is to next thing is to load the paper. So we can load the paper in the rear paper tray. Confirm on the main screen. Take the paper tray out. Once your printer is connected, you will get a printer check network connection sheet. You can register printer with the Epson or you can do it later. You will see the main screen and there is a Wi-Fi signal on the top. Any device for wireless printing and scanning. For example, I am going to edit in my iPhone. So go to the iPhone and open the Epson iPrint app. You can download this app from the App Store. Here we have to add the printer. So on the top of the screen you will see there is a printer section. So select this bar. 
again select it and it will display the printer series 2720 select it automatically it will install the printer it will show up all the details once you select it go to the home button and you will see the printer series displayed on the top from here we can start using for wireless printing and scanning for example I'm going to show you how to print so click on the print document select any document you want to print and click on the print button paper output tray is here so it's quick So print quality is good but if you want to increase it you can simply go and go to the maintenance section in the main screen and do the print head alignment. So this way we can do the complete setup of this printer and then we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. If you want you can add it in many devices and you can use it wirelessly. Thanks for watching.